Yo guys, how you all getting on? It's John here once again on the second part of my video. This is macros and glyphs that I'm going to talk about. So let's get into it. Um, just the basic glyphs that I use and one that I changes in arena, and I'll tell you why I changed it is is we get into the glyphs that I use 99% of the time. So the main glyphs that I use. So we get into the glyph to the harsh word. This just gives you a word of glory. You can do damage with it. Often, often helps on kill targets. It's very, very, very good. But you don't need to heal. You have a full load of holy power, so you start busting damage out. Helping DPS is very important in this glyph. I think everybody should use it. If you have a good communication with your teammates and you know that they can CC targets and stop damage a lot, and you don't have to heal a lot, and you can get damage out, use this. And with my team, I can do it, so I use it. So, so yeah, that's one of the main glyphs, and this is the one that changes out. The only one that changes out all the time. So the next one I get in is a uh, glyph to the flash of light. Whenever you flash a light, a target increases your next healing done to that target within 7 seconds by 10%. Now, very, very, very important because if you don't get the proc for your um, Fire Divine Light to, to hit, um, if you don't get the proc for the, fa for the fast cast, you're just going to be spamming flash a light and holy shock and word of glory for heals, but mostly flash a light. So, 10% on the target that you're healing is huge it's huge it's very important that you use this glyph and always use this glyph don't ever change it out so yeah so that's the second glyph now my third glyph is glyph to divine protection it reduces the magic damage and reduces of all your divine protections to 20 percent but adds a 20 percent physical damage reduction very very good when you're playing a kind of high rating you get a kind of low rating as well is warrior uh, mage and druid healer or shaman healer and when they switch on you you use that Absolutely, yeah, because you're stopping 20% of the magic damage the mage doing, and you're stopping 20% of the physical damage the warrior is doing. Now, as well, I have a macro as well that I, when I pop my, pop that, I use my trinket, my Batmaster's trinket as well. So, yeah, I just get into that macro now in a second with you. So, that's the glyphs that I use. The only one that I change is in this one is when I'm against Warlocks, DKs, and I change Turn Evil for Harsh Words. And why I use why I change it because you need to keep the warlocks pet away, but you need to keep the DK and holy DK's pet away. So when you're against them comps, it changes the turn evil from our swords and keeps the rest because you're gonna need it because it's very important that you keep these ones. Like if you can get in case you're against a lock warrior or something like that, you have that magic and physical damage reduction when you need to use it. So <coughs> that's my uh, glyphs guys. I'll get into my macros now, real quick backwards that I use okay so as I said I was control 1 and control 2 is my freedom macros so it's class target the person's name hand of freedom and for my second one same thing slash ta and the same thing as the first one so I have that as control 1 and control 2 there's my freedom ones Um we'll get into devotion aura I have this is a when I pop devotion aura it just just spams flash a light on myself so it's just show tool tips devotion or uh, slash stop casting slash cast devotion or slash cash flash a light and then slash p devotion or as you can see there copy that put in your macros and then just put the, whatever you want to say slash say heal like a boss I, that's what comes up when i pop this and i'll just show you now as you can see there flashes light myself and says to the lads i'm healing like a boss healing like a champion yeah so yeah so that's that macro for you that's the cleanse macro this one is just slash focus so my focus target um that's just a f change change focus a lot um very important to have one of these in binders because if you're a healer you will change it a lot um this one is divine protection one i was telling you about it's just show two tips divine protection slash cast divine protection use 14. now use 14 is the numbers here so that's 13 the top one 14 is the bottom one just remember that so if you have your Batmaster's trinket or any trinket you want to use like that um, make sure you put the right number so if that one's up top you, you put down slash use 13 and not 14 if you use the bottom like I am it's slash, uh, slash use 14 so that's that one done I'll get into the next one that I use is do -do 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 targets slash tower you don't have to put down target uh, have it as Q slash tower John Agro so it targets myself as you can see when I pop that um, then just targets targets me second person and targets me third person for healing so it's like E and R so 
my two mates are in out I'm Q it's absolutely basic it's simple so that's what you want to do Um, have some red things here so all my kind of macros are kind of a bit all over the place this one is just a uh, um, my kick so slash slash rebuke cast focus target focus rebuke so very important you have that one as well guys because you will need to interrupt so so that's basically the only macros that I use as a holy pattern they are more I know they are so if you've any very good ones that I kind of need to use or should use um, let me know in the comments below if there's some epic ones because I could try some out um, then I've just, just this one is this is this is a good one actually <coughs> um, it's uh, your hammer rat it just it's just um, you don't need to target on it so anyone that's below that you can hit with that the minute they're below that sort of health that you can hit them with you just hit you just press that and it'll, and it'll just throw it at them straight away you'll just hit them with that you don't need to target them or not so you should have this one as well guys this this gets kills so yeah so yeah guys um, thanks for uh, watching this video and if you want to see more guides and epic pvp action hit that subscribe leave some comments down below and yeah thanks very much guys see you later